All right, so a really common question I get is how fast is the Hadron XX? So I fly an 18 meter Hadron XX. I'm about 100 kilograms all up, uh, maybe a little bit more than that. So I just did a little speed test to check that out. Um, here we go. Check, check. All right, I'm gonna do a quick test. So a while back, somebody asked me uh, how fast is the Hadron XX. Um, I don't know. So let's do a quick test. I'm at about 800 feet. And we're gonna do all the configurations. So we'll start with full slow. So full slow on the Hadron, woo, is trims in, flaps in. So I'm pulling the flaps in right now. And this is on the Hadron 18 meter. I'm about 100 kilograms all up. I weigh about 148, 149 pounds, 150 we'll say. And then plus my gear is about 100 kilograms. So, okay, full slow in this direction. And I'll go back the other way and we'll average it, stick in the council wind. But, okay, so full slow right now is 25 miles an hour. 20, now it's 27, 25. So we'll say 26 miles an hour, full slow. So always let the flaps out before you even touch the trimmer. So that's flaps out. We are going 30 miles an hour. Okay, so gain about four there. Now let's go trimmers all the way out. Big speed jump there. So we'll let it settle. So that was 25, then about 30, now about 39, 40 miles an hour. Now let's kick the speed bar. No one to touch brakes at this point either, so this is speed bar now. Holy shit! 50! <laughs> 48. Damn, dude, so that's... Okay, so we'll go back in. Okay, that was more than I thought. Uh, that was, I doubled my speed on this thing, 25 to 50. Just, just in configuration, so between the flaps, what am I looking at here? Just between the flaps here, trimmers and speed bar which is here so all right i'm gonna go full slow again go the other way and we'll average it because i know i got a tailwind going this way man those flaps make this thing sluggy okay so we're gonna turn around go back this way full 180 there we go all right man i made up some ground <laughs> i was at that field when i started all right so now we're going 22 miles an hour. So I had about a three mile an hour tailwind. Looks like I had about a three mile an hour tailwind before. Okay, so we're going 21, 22, 22 we'll call it. 22 full slow in this direction. Okay, flap all the way out. Let that settle. That's 27. We gained about four miles, four or five miles an hour. 26. We'll call that 26. Okay, now we're gonna let the trippers out. Get a bunch of speed here off. I'll show you. Okay, so one, two, three, out. See that speed jump. About 30, 35, 36, 37. Call that 36, I average. All right, now we're gonna go speed bar. 
Grab my tip toggles here just in case. I'll show you full speed. Here we go. That's full speed bar. You can see that thing's bottomed out. That's 42, 41, 43, 45. Okay, so the other way was about 50, this is about 44. Average between the two is 47. So we'll call it the max speed of the Hadron XX. 18 meter at about 100 kilograms. We'll say that. I don't know how much gas I have, but I just did 47 miles an hour, so that's quick. That's quick, man. Pretty cool. Alright, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this flight. Peace. So there you go. Um, yeah, about 46, 47 miles an hour, I think was the top speed I got off that. I took a mile an hour off because as I was editing it, I noticed that <clears throat> that initial downwind full speed run is probably closer to 48, 49 miles an hour. So yeah, you get about 46, 47 miles an hour top speed out of the Hadron, which is pretty cool. Um, so the next video I post will be me finally flying my new wing. Um, I finally got a chance to get to take that up. Uh, and I did do a little speed test on it, so we'll be able to compare uh, the new wing speed to the Hadron speed, even though I'm not really looking for another fast wing, um, but it'll be interesting nonetheless. And also, I got a chance to test out the PPG Smoke uh, chase cam last time. So, um, I got some pretty cool footage off that and it worked really well. Yep, so that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Peace.